welcome new subscribers and welcome back old subscribers so today's video will be a product review and a hairstyle so yes we've got some mail coming so I've actually been waiting to do this review for quite some time these products are from the main guru and what I liked about these you go to this website you take this test and first question is what does your hair look like with no product you select whatever one is the best option the next screen is or what does your hair feel like you also have an option to choose your hair porosity which you can do on your own time and then it gives you what your hair type is and it sends out a box of products for your specific hair type and I've never seen a hair subscription box do something like this so I thought that was very unique and the process was very simple so this is how my package came and just a little bit more about this company they are a hair subscription company so they send out travel size or full size products of different products for your specific hair type and the first thing i noticed was how well this box is put together i thought it was super cute so you open it up it has a little quote on the top and my box came with four products in it the first product was the Babasu conditioning cleanser there was a Babasu hydrating conditioner and a shea butter hair cream I believe yeah shea butter hair cream and last but not least I got this cashmere aromatic oil all of these products were from this company called natural roots and I also thought that it was really nice that my box included these little midi rings so I had two midi rings and even a little cross charm that I thought was really special. So first I started off with the cleanser. So I made sure my hair was soaking wet. So here's just what the texture of the cleanser was like. It was very silky, um, not really heavy. I really like the smell of it. It just had a fresh scent. I, I can't really put my finger on it. Um, but yeah, I applied it to my scalp and as you can see, it didn't lather for me at all. Um, but that's not unusual for my hair. If I wait more than a week to wash my hair, it typically doesn't lather the first time around. So I always shampoo my hair twice anyway. So this was the first go around and I applied a whole lot of it. I actually used the whole bottle. This was the second rinse and you see it lathered a little bit more, but it still didn't give me any crazy suds like, you know nothing crazy um, but I really did like the shampoo it did make my hair feel clean but not stripped at all and that's exactly what it says on the bottle so I really enjoyed this cleanser so next after rinsing it out I moved on to the conditioner and this was the texture of the conditioner it was super super thick it took me a little bit of effort to get it out of the bottle now I was not crazy about this scent it had like a light licorice smell to me kind of but I did like how it applied to my hair. So this conditioner doubles as either a rinse out or a deep conditioner. So I chose to use it as a deep conditioner. And here you can see that it even made my curls pop a little bit. They were trying to come through. So I did some finger detangling with it. I put a shower cap on and I ended up leaving it on for about an hour. And here was my hair after leaving it on for an hour. My hair felt super soft, which you can't tell from this video. But as you can tell from my face, it was super soft. And yes, my shrinkage was in full effect as usual. So I just left that in and then I went to rinse it out afterwards. Next, I moved on to the Shea Butter Hair Cream. And here was the texture of that. It had like a silky kind of feel to it, but it definitely felt moisturizing. I also was not crazy about this scent. It had the same smell as the conditioner to me, so I wasn't really a big fan, but once again, I do like how it felt on my hair. I followed up with the cashmere oil, and I really like this stuff. Like, this must have had peppermint or something in it because it felt so good on my scalp. So I just put that on top and then I just proceeded to put all the sections of my hair into little French braids just so my hair can stretch while it dried. Once I was done braiding all my hair, here's what it looked like. I just put a scarf on my hair and I pretty much went to bed after that. I ended up leaving my hair in these braids for a few days. 
and this is what I looked like after like three or four days um, so here's just me unbraiding my hair and I didn't want to torture you so I'm just gonna fast forward that and this is what my hair looked like after it was done being unbraided so you can see that my hair had a nice sheen on it and I think it was just from that combination especially from that oil and my hair smelled amazing so I didn't even mind the smell uh, from that um, shea butter hair cream because the oil really covered it up so I wanted to just do another stretch to see how this worked as a styler so I ended up sectioning off my hair applying some water and reapplying the shea butter hair cream and just putting my hair into some medium sized flat twist all around and as you can see I just went through all the sections and repeated those same steps all over Once I was done with the flat twist, I ended up pulling my hair back into a bun just to wear it as a style and I just twisted it up and used a bobby pin to secure it and then I just put my scarf on again and went to bed. So the next day here was my hair. It was all dry and I just took the flat twist out. I used the cashmere oil again and I just applied some on my fingertips. Um, and I just took the twist out. So once again, I didn't want to torture you again by watching me take all of these out. So we're just gonna fast forward through that too. And bam, here we are, last twist. And this is what my hair was looking like before fluffing or doing anything. So I had a good amount of definition through the top, which you can see there. And my hair was stretched very well. Here you can see the back of my hair and I did have some frizz but I personally don't care for definition so I took a comb and I went through and really fluffed this out. I combed my hair pretty much from roots to ends just because I like volume more than definition and here was the final result. So I really liked how all these products felt on my hair. I would definitely recommend heading over to hairguru.com and taking a test for yourself and getting your hands on one of these boxes. If you do, I do have a code which is NYAC that you can use to save some money on your purchase. But I hope you enjoyed this video guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.